G'day guys, Greg here. Now, it's product review time, and one of my fans, Dylan Kelly, wanted me to review this product right here. Herbert Adams Gourmet Vegetarian Delights. Ah. Cream cheese, spinach, and savory rolls. Mm. Now, Dylan guarantees me that this is like a 10 out of 10. Minimum 9 out of 10 food, this one. And I must say, it does look absolutely delicious. Now it says cream cheese. I wonder how much cheese is actually in this. Ooh, I hope it's 105%. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh? Well, here it says cream cheese, 16%. And then spinach is 11%. And well, that's about all that you need to know. But really, that's only 27%. So what's the other 73% then? Well, there's 2% onion, which means there's like 70% of stuff. Anyway, he reckons this is so awesome tasting. I wonder how many I can eat in a whole day if it is that good. Oh, here it says that each one is 2,160 kilojoules. Boy, that is like quite a lot. That means you can only have like four of each individual ones of these every day and still have a body like the hungry guy. Mind you, it's 380 grams and each one of these is 190 grams. So that's pretty good. Anyway, let's crack it open, suss it out, see what they look like. Oh yeah. It's got to be five inches long. That's what she said. And the girth, mate, that is thick. That's what she said. But so far, it's looking pretty good. Right, how do we cook these things? Oh, it's on here. <laughs> well, you can either cook it in the oven at 175 degrees Celsius for 35 minutes. That sounds like a lot of electricity. Or you can nuke it in the old micro nuker for two minutes. <laughs> Jeez, <laughs> that's all right. But then you're left with a soggy mess. So today, I'm going to be using my trusty old air fryer. Right. Now, usually when I'm using the air fryer, I usually half plus add a little bit of time of whatever the packet says for the oven. So that says 35 minutes. So I'll do it for 180 at maybe oh, 19 minutes. And we'll see how that goes. All right. Well, the time has gone off. Ooh. That looks all right. Oh, there's some crispiness there, yummo. Well, it's smelling pretty good. It's cutting in half. Let's see what it looks like. And pray that it's cooked. Mmm. Well, it's definitely looking cream cheesy and spinachy there. Oh. oh wow, almost looks like seaweed. And is this cooked? Yeah, my finger is burning. Gee, that pastry looks good. Mmm, light, fluffy and buttery. All right, come at me. Oh. oh, Dylan, I see what you mean. That filling really does have a nice creaminess about it. And you can taste the crunch of that onion in there too. It all blends in really nicely together. And the little bit of spinach just adds that little bit of flavor there. It does have this slight tartiness about it though. You, you know that flavor? You know that cheesy, frozen, processed flavour that you get sometimes? Well, this has got it. 
It could be because of the spinach in there, but mate, all together, yeah, that little crunch of the onion and the crunch of the spinach there with the cheese, with that pastry over the top, mate, this is really nice. Mmm. Mmm. That cream cheese can become a little bit grainy sometimes and the saltiness of it, well, sometimes it tastes really salty and other times it tastes like you need to add salt to it. <laughs> Crazy times. Now, Dylan reckons it's a minimum 9 out of 10. Well, you know what? I think it could be an 8.9 out of 10. Although, if you push me, it could be a 9 out of 10. But it is very tasty. But it doesn't matter what Dylan or I think about it. The ultimate authority is the Grego meter. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's going to go straight up because, I mean, I thought it was really great and Dylan thought it was... Oh, hang on. But Dylan said it was really tasty and 9 out of 10, if not 10 out of 10. So I can't understand why it was... Oh, here it comes. It's coming back up. You little ripper. Yeah, this is the way it's gonna go for sure. Or what? But it's so creamy and delicious and it's vegetarian. Oh no, oh, I shouldn't have said that. Come on, get up there mate, get up there. Oh, so close. These cream cheese and spinach savoury rolls are really tasty. They're pretty hard to fault. But, you know, they, they, they could be a little bit better, I reckon. There's something about the frozen cream cheese that just has this tartiness and, well, it, it, it's really tasty. Don't get me wrong. It'd be hard to make it tastier, actually. It's really good. And I don't care what the Grego meter says. I reckon this is a good... Straight thumbs up. But the Grego meter, well, it's what we all go by, so no, but I reckon this is really tasty, really delicious, and well, coming up to Christmas, mate, what a perfect thing to add on the menu when the people come over and drink all your grog. You can shove some of these into them, it'll fill them up, and they won't drink as much as they probably could have. That'll save you money. Well, there you go, Herbert Adams Vegetarian Delights, Cream Cheese and Spinach, Savory Rolls. They're pretty tasty, and I reckon if you went out and grabbed them, you're going to enjoy them. Anyway, I hope this video helps you decide what to try, what to buy, and what to avoid. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. I eat a savoury roll. Catch you later. Ooh, yeah. This is great. It's a weathering.